Hey Cam fans, what's up? Today I will be showing you guys my Dungeons and Dragons collection. Well, technically it was more of a haul. I got this book for Christmas and on Saturday, today's Thursday by the way, on um, this week's Saturday, I'll be learning how to play Dungeons and Dragons. Dungeons and Dragons is not cheap. This miniature was five dollars this miniature was nine dollars these dice were twelve dollars this guy was eight bucks but uh i got a deal so i didn't have to pay for him i got a deal because since i was getting all this other stuff they just gave me that one for free so really nice so i also have the dungeons and dragons monsters and creatures book you know it's pretty cool let me just here for an example a cloud giant it shows you it says the powers on this side are nice picture. The corner, how big it is, and some some things about them. They're up their lair. And then what you should do and don't shouldn't do. And let me find a legendary. Now let me find Tiamat and for legendary creatures. It says lair. Some information. Size. How to fight them. Monster compared to the person. And different heads. And back to more stuff about fight. So, pretty good book. Has a lot of monsters. I'll show you them all. If somebody wants to pause the video and read each one, go ahead. That book was like five bucks. I got it five. I was, it, it, I found it at five below. So, and then this book. I went into the store with a, uh, uh, over over ninety dollars, and I came out with seven dollars and eighty five cents. I spent eighty two dollars and fifteen cents at that store. Most of this was on the player's handbook. A single book. There's over 300 pages, and I have no idea what any of them mean. Like, what is this supposed to mean? What does this all mean? Uh, so, so there's one of these things. And there's a character sheet at the end. So, you know, that's pretty cool. But, uh, Dungeons & Dragons books? Expensive. 